It's finally over. Can't a guy get some privacy? At least when he's taking a dump? I'm afraid not. These fights don't work like that. It's time to die, Mr. First Rank. You gotta be shitting me! Will you hurry up with that? I'll be outside. That was close. Thanks. Ugh. What an idiot. You're a disgrace to yourself and all those you've killed. Huh. <sighs>
right moments inside the cutscene. You do see the person is using a four-way cross-graded bling, bling, bling katana. It can't be nobody else besides him. Look at that. It's right there. It is right there. Now, I first thought maybe it was some video mistakes, but we were getting to So I might say, it's, it's not good. It's not good. The cross get it like that, the, the cross out uh bean katana is not good enough. If it's not good enough, then I got some more. Alright. I just got, got some more. Now, there's this quick shot. Quick shot of where Travis. Well, well, well there's a final piece. There's, there's, there's final piece. Now, now, anytime before, you never said that Travis and Henry look like twins. Because they don't. They don't look like identical twins to me. Unless you want to talk about a DMC5 type situation where it went from identical twins to non identical twins. I don't see how that happens, but apparently it, it could, it could not, not that iffy. But uh, I don't know if the face was in the video. It seems like it's rather Henry, rather he, really the fact that he got divorced in Syria and he's all alone with Mad and decided, hey, I'm gonna be with my brother Travis now. I'm gonna grow my hair out, wear shades. That's all it's gonna take. Or it could be theory number two. But before we get to theory number two, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna address. Uh, I can dress I can dress I can dress it. It's so also just cast a to be wearing hair, not just one, but two bean katanas. With a cross, with a four way cross guard, like uh, bean uh, cross guard. Which technically here is only known for one, and this bean katana is always green. Everybody knows this in the fan base, and when we played the first game, the second game knows this. And there would be no reason why Henry would truly use two green bean katanas. So. I thought, I thought it was about Henry. Well, technically, I don't know. But the reason I said I don't know is it could be one or two things. Is that this is Henry, who has lost his mind, and uh, now he's going to get back at Travis. We don't know what truly happened at that final fight and in the first game. We don't know what happened. Or two, this is one of the, uh, the top four guys, the top not for top nine guys on the Glass Superhero rankings creating some type of green illusion. Now there are two different characters that are green, but I can't pinpoint which character would actually do it. And it's just like, is it my last speech is, this is outside of Travis' apartment. And we know that we already have, we already know there is a common premise with no my hero trailers. It's number one, it's really going to show off something important, or we show off game. As a number one, the first review trailer that Ugh, that that dub, that dub, my God! What what happened? Is this before you? Be, or this is before you caused Captain Hero a million to the roll? Before you got Robin here? This the struggle is real. Then there's like that no more here is two review trailer. And it's just no more two re, two review trailer. I, I could maybe I found the wrong one, but it just it really didn't go too deep anything. It just showed up, you know, the first fight, we traveled some gameplay with the, beam, with the new uh, dual winning beam katanas, and that's pretty much it. But, uh, in this case, in No More Heroes 3, I do think it has some significance. The question is, who is the idiot who decided, eh, I'm going to pull up the Travis's doorstep, I'm going to kill him now. And the thing is, why would they be interested in Travis in the first place? Why would Fu in his game be interested in Travis in the first place? Now, that, that was just what we're getting conspiracy theory there to it, because we know that Sylvia is inside the game. Now, that's Sylvia. Now, her name is Sylvia. Sylvia. That's not Charlotte. Crystal. Sylvia Crystal. I might be saying that name wrong, but I'm correct some other time. See, we all know she does have him vomit into this entire process due to the whole reveal trail. Well, the official trailer of No Mickey. No, 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 no. Was it? Yeah, yeah, you can see the reveal trailer of No More Heroes. She was there at the end, playing around with the cherries, and she has a hot people involved. I just can't pinpoint how. How do we go from assassin to galactic superhero? Man? Now, if it was in any other game, any other game, I'd be like, what the fuck are they doing? What, what is this? What the fuck are we doing here? But there's No More Heroes, and this can't really go anywhere. Even at all. So I'll make a food video about the entire game for the time. But it's just... I don't know how CB ties into this. I don't know how any of this... Because let's think, I can't tell you outright that this is not him. I can't. This very well could be a mind control Henry, or uh, actual Henry, that lost his mind. But the reason I can't say it's outright Henry is for one simple reason. The fact that if you look at his face, it's just... It looks more like Travis 
but it could just be one of the, uh, the top nine Galactic, uh, one of the top nine uh, superheroes from the Galactic Superhero rankings, plus it's up a mind to lose no tricks. The reason I said there are two different characters, two different characters that you could be, and technically it's three, it's three test points, but I'm gonna say two. And the reason I say two is because like, number one, you have that girl in the chair. And the one that got the bang over her eye, you want to see that one eye that sucks out through the sunglasses. She could be the one to actually be doing this because, not the one from the, uh, the cuts when you showed up on the ship, but the one who crashed this Henry slash Travis and losing of, you know, what a Travis should place with his brother, and you know, he ended up with two cross guard, like, cross guard beam katanas like he did in the second game. It could be a possibility. The reason why they say it could, because, you know, she got the Casey 395. Or well, Tacey, oh no, no, is it Tacey or Tushy? At least Tacey 359 from a symbiotic Titan on that uh, on her lap, so it's just like she really would really need to do this, but it still could be a possibility. She's still wearing green, it still counts. The other one is that is that is that long arm motherfucker who I nicknamed Blue 42, not long arm, long legged motherfucker. I named Blue 42, gets the football color, and the reason not 42, 48. And the reason why I say this because because this individual could be a female, and that's not the reason why. I just, I'm just going on a basic character description. Could be a female. On top of that, she's wearing a lot of green, and it's like she's a machine. Got one eye, and it's just she got long legs. It's, it's mainly the fact that she's only connection with green, and the fact that she could be a completely cyborg, cybernetic alien or somewhere in between. In between. So. With that main eye lens, she can cause some type of illusion. Only problem is that eye is blue and not green. It sure is it possible for it to turn green? Yes, but it's just another effort. But someone else who was the last guy, and this one, I've never heard theorizing this about before. And you got that green guy in the front, who I just call it Waspinator 2.0. That, that's what it looks like. Waspinator here looked like he could be a poison man. Is the fact that he look weird holding some type of gas weapon, and he's, he's, he's striking the poses with the weapons in his hand? Probably. Could he audition for the Captain Ginyu Force? More than likely. But uh, it's just, it is what it is. He could be a possibility, but it's unknown if you use him type of losing ports or not. Because it's still like with all these sparklers flying off Henry, or the mystery man here. It could be either way. It could be mind control. It could just be some type of effect for the game. It could be. Then my fellas, the game's not finished. It was just, just some trailer for it. Bullshit. I'm not trying to hear it. The reason why, number one, my opinion is actual gameplay. Two, you just don't have that many sparkles coming off a character on a basic green game model. I'm not hearing that bullshit, man. It's some type of illusion, or it could be illusion from the ship itself. We don't know what type of weaponry or high-tech alien weaponry our boy food in this game from the black hole prison could obtain. We don't know it. At least, at least I don't know it. I'm, the, I, I'm not a part of the grass talking about the fact I don't make these games. But it could be either one of the solutions. But even one of the ants, because it looks like it looks like Henry, in my opinion. There's too many things. They like to analyze the cross guard. You got the exact it's white and it ends with gold. The only other person to have a cross guard like that is Henry. Literally. And also another theory came up with what is not only is Henry lost his mind and won't be like Travis's brother, who basically took his wife and took his life. Now some people say Travis has children. It's that girl at the end of No More Heroes 1 is his child. I can't confirm it or not yet. I'm questioning that wiki sources. I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm, I'm, until I get an official answer, I'm not saying no. Because it is, he, if he does have two children, which is Gene 2.0, and some person named Hunter, and some child named Hunter, then it makes sense why in Travis Straits again, he was just, uh, he was out here in the wilderness. The child approach has caught up to him, he can't take it no more. <laughs> he can't take it no more. He was poor before. But now he's getting now that technically we don't know how much assassin gets paid. And maybe Travis got a stack of money in the mattress. And you know, just uh Henry woke up and just said, uh, this shit is too comfortable. Where's the where's the money? And he just said Who who knows? Who knows? There's too many possibilities. Two. Cause all we know is him uh, Henry and Sylvia met ten years ago. And technically we don't know what Henry actually does for a job. You know, like in a No More Heroes 2, he was like, fuck this shit, I'm out. This, this shit has gotten too crazy. All right, I can fight a losing anime chicks. But, but actual big ass floating, uh, full of air balloons? No, no, Travis, Travis, it's all up to you. You, you can take this. It, you, you care for this shit. I, I, I was only here to support you, but it's, this has gone out too far. Too, too, too. But, uh, yeah, it, it's only to be those, those possibilities. I just want to go with the fact that Henry, this is actually Henry. There's like, there's no other option. This is Henry. 
this is him in my control or uh, this is an illusion. I'm going for like the last two. That, it would be I mean, it, it, there's no real reason for him to actually do this or get another beam katana. The tech we don't know how the last fight ended. So it could be the fact that Travis just let his brother live or him he let his brother live or it is technically just temporary slightly like, classic challenge and say fuck him, I'm gonna go home. No one here was too. Tra uh, 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 Henry was pretty happy. I mean, pretty e even though he, he he left Sylvia, he just didn't have one just shred of hatred in, in, in his brother. Oh, it's for his brother. Uh, but he said, "Travis, my brother." <laughs> he said, Henry, Henry, "Henry's choice of women is terrible." So you know, every once in a while, she just she just she just runs off somewhere. Cause you know, I don't know, like making out. What does Henry do for a job? At least Travis is an assassin, but she still got the whole ULA situation. Who is the ULA? What are their goals? Now, I don't know what the abbreviation stands for, so I'm not going to claim that I can remember. Pretty sure it's said before. Maybe the uh, United Assassins Association. More than likely. But uh, if, they're, uh, if they're setting this stuff up, if ULA has something to do with this thing, and, and, and let's just say, Damon, Damon is an interesting character. Because we don't know what he can do. Now, as in, will he be a boss? Will he try to protect food? Or will he be on the food side? Or will he be some type of betrayal where food just casually murders him like he's Marjorie Drew or somebody else? We don't know how the relationship between food and Damon turns out after the betrayal begins and after food obliterates about thousands of people or something. So, more likely someone close to Santa destroyed the food. Because let's say, this, this entire thing happened. We don't know if this stuff is happening in Travis Strikes again. We don't know if this is happening in No More Heroes 2. We don't, because it's been like 20 goddamn years. So it's just like, all this entire time we've not seen one single tower with this purple shit on it, with all these uh, technical strips and that, uh, like, I think you say pieces of metal, curved metal points and out of it. I don't know. Maybe, fool, let's say, you know what, damn, fuck this shit. Ah, blow him up because he got the ET touch. I read the ET touch is a deadly disease. The cheese touch is one thing, but the ET touch has killed millions. But, uh. Ryan yeah, I don't have any, too many other possibilities. It was just me just overanalyzing shit, more than likely. Because I'm telling you, I, before my channel was destroyed, I was knee deep in the series. And for these games and shit, I, 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 I was there. If the One Piece series go on, I still please care if you're in zero. But it's just, uh, this one is quite clear. It might cry some content, this conversation, even though no one watches the videos. But, uh, yeah, is this. Do you guys think this is him? Do you guys believe any of the options I came up with? If you gain anything from this video, who do you think this mystery man is? Because to me, this is more than likely. It, it's, it's some type of form of Henry. It has to be. Because the, the, the jacket's the same, the boots are the same, the pants are the same. It is, unless it's some type of VR reality game, but I don't see why I. I don't see why I would have so much, so much spark and some bleed on. It looks like a hologram in my team. So a VR game would create the same effect. It's not like Travis actually doing the final blow on this guy and actually killing them or killing the hologram. But it's just this could be a boss fight, could be a side mission. And how does this tie in with destroyment? That's the we, there's so many things about the ULA we don't know. Cause it's just there. And so what is connection is uh, what is Sylvia's direct connection to the ULA? She worked for him who some of them guys at the Solid Harmies died, but that's pretty much shit. We don't know if the ULA is just some type of giant massive cat scam and people just it's just like you should. You do have to pay an entry fee. And it, it is not likely a scam to a certain degree. It's just a big ass joke. But it's just there's gotta be something more. Cause there's no way assassins is just, ah, I become number one, I become number 50, I got all the money, man, I got, I got all the money. How? Well, this is to make me with a rapid, but everybody else is just like, Rock City was death metal. What the fuck you get that magic from? What is he, a fucking rap star? Ra rock star? How the fuck you get that money? And everybody else, how do you afford the, all these beam katanas and shit? How? Who are the ULA? Why are the ULA are joining up with Fu's, with Fu's entire game? to create this Galactic Hero Association. And the reason why, because the way Travis reacts to is just like, we got Galactic Superhero Rankings now? I, I guess so. 2020 release! <laughs> Good luck! And also, they also, uh, also in the Strowman video, I forgot to bring up that Student 51 said they are making, working on a 5 minute trailer, so it's gonna be some more gameplay. So, well, I heard some person claim that it'll be released in early this year. I won't be able to play it, but I'm damn sure we're reporting the news on it. Or we'll just try to 
burn out whatever type of series I, I get get all this stuff off my head now before the game comes out. But it's just that I don't know, Billy. I, 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 I don't even know. I just, there's, there's so many theories, there are a thousand things that's going through my cranium at once. And it's just like, you got, there's, there's so many elements to this. So it's just like, there's, there's layers of complications, but really, you got the Syrian Christmas uh, 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 entire dynamic. You got food, and you got this, this mysterious guy who could be hearing or not. And then if this is not hearing, there's some type of illusion, then what the fuck is the man hearing? Because he's not in Travis Strikes again. Shinobu shows it at the end. Batman, it's just like bad girl shows up at the end, so maybe she's a part of the crew or not, but it's just like the plus we don't even have no attention. Why would Travis come back again? Like that's the first time is getting some sweet ass and becoming number one. Second time is getting the full course of that sweet ass and becoming number one. Yeah! Third time is just uh especially with all this emotional drama and then uh Travis strikes again. Well 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 that emotional trauma, self reflection in Travis Strikes again, and how No More Heroes 2 you start out with Travis just being alone. It's just a. Uh, no one knows. I, mean, I really love him. It's just that. Uh, what a story could go. How. So there's so many different elements. And this is like, you gotta fucking destroy me! Returning. So it's, you got all these elements back to back stacked up. It's just like, really, where are we going? Unlike, unlike with other games where I've doubted, I, I don't have any bad attention for it. Right? Unlike, unlike with Doom Eternal, I'm, I'm concerned for it. So I was a bit, I'm not gonna get into that. I'm not gonna get into that. But I'm concerned for that game. It's just like, I, I've never had no outright just bad feelings or sensors to Travis, uh, No More Heroes 3. So I just, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the series. I hope you guys enjoyed whatever type of mindless rambling guy I've been doing this entire time. And it's just, uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed Because I, I basically live here, right? To a certain degree. I, I, gotta, I gotta find out the answers. I gotta find the truth! Truth! Also, it took me 12 days. It took decades to upload that DMC video. I've had to export that video about five to six times. No one's watching it. I'm crying. No one's watching it. But it's it. I put so much work in it. And it's it. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the series here. And then Mr. Before the Shop Game Team. I, I don't think y'all actually get, get anything from these videos. This is a bunch of rambling. And maybe you can slap together some type of theory here, but yeah, this is me just my evidence and why my fear. This is this is your boy Harry. That's what that's what that's what I think. So uh, yeah, people Mr. Shop Game King, do you believe Henry will return? What do you think the URA situation and see if you have to do with this? And what do you think of the whole concept of now we have galactic superheroes? But I hope you enjoyed the video. This has been Shockwave King and the...